Welcome to the solutions video on the topic of forward ordering. In this video, we will examine the functionality of forward ordering. Let's look at the definition of forward ordering. Forward ordering is the ability to pre-order next day's jobs using New Day in order that the connected jobs will be available for execution at their specified time zone. To better understand forward ordering, first we will start with a question. Why am I seeing in the monitoring domain two sets of identical folders or two sets of identical jobs? Looking closer at our screen, we can see two identical folders named Smart Table with Time Zone. One folder and its jobs show current O date, and the second folder and its jobs show tomorrow's date. Let's look at a real use case. Assuming your new day is running at 7 a.m. in Houston Central Standard Time, you are a global organization that has business both in Melbourne, Australia and in Houston, Texas. At the end of the workday, jobs are scheduled to run to close day's activities. First job is scheduled to run at 1900 Melbourne time, and the second job needs to follow in 1900 Houston time. Both jobs close the business activities for today's workday. If the jobs are placed in New Day, which is 7 a.m. Houston time on Monday, the Melbourne job will run immediately because that hour has already passed. By using forward ordering, the New Day places the jobs in AJF one day in advance. And when the New Day time is reached in Melbourne time zone, the job becomes eligible to run and then executes at the specified from time. In this example, both jobs are placed in AJF on Sunday Central Standard Time, however, with run date option to execute on Monday at their designated time zone. On Sunday at 1400 Houston Time, which is also 7 a.m. Melbourne Time, the first job becomes eligible to run because the new day time at the time zone has arrived. And the job runs based on its from time 1900 AEST. At 7 a.m. Central Time on Monday, the second job is now eligible to run because that is the start of the new day in Houston. And based on its from time, the job will run in 1900 CST. Both jobs run with Monday as its order date. Having ability to forward order the smart folder allows each job to run at its designated time zone and time. Now let's look at the details of forward ordering. In version 8 and higher, the configuration parameter that enables this functionality is gd underscore forward, or general daily forward, which is another word for new day. In version 7 and below, the parameter is ctm underscore gd underscore forward. Forward ordering is performed when one of the following two criteria are met. One. When we have a smart folder with time zone defined at the smart folder level, all the jobs in this folder are forward ordered, and consideration is given to the run date. As compared to a smart folder that has no time zone specified, the jobs in this folder are ordered with current O date and are eligible to run immediately. Item number two, regular folders. Jobs with time zone specified will be forward ordered, while jobs with no time zone specified will not be forward ordered, instead will run immediately. Therefore, the best practice for forward ordering is to use smart folder because all the jobs are connected with the same O date. If using a regular folder, the best practice is not to mix time zone and non-time zone jobs in the same regular folder. Additional pointers to remember. Item number three, forward ordering is done automatically by new day order only and not by any other type of ordering that is done through utilities or through EM user. In forward ordering, jobs are ordered for O date plus one always. 
For example, Sunday's New Day orders folders for Monday. The 48 hour window is needed in order to be able to cover the time of all time zones. However, during these 48 hours, there is only one specific 24 hour window where these jobs are active. When the jobs are not active, they assume the state of out of time window. Let's look at some examples. Here we have one smart folder that is ordered first and the 20th at new day time. Since the folder has time zone specified, AEST, its O date is set for the 21st. The next day on the 21st new day, the same folder is ordered again with O date of 22nd and so on. The next example is a regular folder. One job in this folder has no time zone specified and at new day of the 21st of December, it's ordered with O date of the 21st. A second job in the same regular folder is forward ordered for 22nd because it has time zone field set. That concludes this Control M solution video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this.